What's going on guys? My name is Marcel Flores. Welcome to my YouTube channel, One Dapper Street. If you're part of the ODS squad, you probably saw my video recently on 12 amazing white t-shirts for your style. Today, I'm gonna try and help you out and show you with five different looks how you can style a white tee. They're endlessly versatile. This is just scraping the surface of what you can do with a white t-shirt. For the entirety of the video, I'll be wearing the white Ankari Floor Saturday sneakers that were just released. They're a little bit of an update to our launch shoe because I think a white t-shirt and a white pair of sneaks just work perfectly together in general. And I'll show that with the five outfits that I have for you guys today. Let's start with the first look that I'm wearing right now and it's a very simple, very classic one. I'm wearing up top a dark denim jacket. This one is from Uniqlo, it fits super nice. It's actually a size small, even though I usually wear a size medium at Uniqlo, I find myself often getting a size small just because it's a little bit more snug. And on the lower half, I'm wearing a pair of page five pocket cotton pants. There's a small difference between chinos and five pocket pants. Really, it doesn't really matter for the video today. So the outfit suggestion is a pair of chinos with a denim jacket up top. I think it's a super simple look. In this case, I'm playing with a little bit of earth tones. It's something that's easily done, but I feel like a lot of guys don't do it. So maybe that opens up a, a new thought pathway for you guys when you're selling your outfits. The second option I've got for you guys is a navy suit. Now, you have heard me talk a lot about wearing suits in a little bit more of a sporty way. In this case, obviously, the sneakers and a t-shirt make it a lot more casual, a lot more sporty, but I don't think not, not office ready. So you can still wear this to the office, of course, you know, depending on the office a little bit. But why I like this is just, it's simple, it's still classy, it's sporty, yet elegant. There's just a nice balance throughout, and personally I like doing it with a navy suit. You could do it with gray, with black, honestly it just works, it's white, white works with everything. And while we're on it, let me actually talk about the t-shirt that I'm wearing now. I think, for me, it is the best t-shirt out of the 12 that I showed you guys in the last video, and that's because it's just super versatile. And that's something that's really important for me in a video like this, where we're going through looks that are a little bit more classy, but then we're also going through looks that are a little bit more edgy. So you saw in the first one, the more casual vibe, I wore it untucked and it worked. And in this case, I'm wearing a tuck, but it's nice and slim, even if I take the blazer off, because you know, it's spring, but also getting into summer, it might get a little bit too hot. It still works for me. I can roll up the sleeves a tiny bit if I want to, to give it a little bit more of an edge, but I really like this, and this shirt is number From Selected, um, it's a brand that Top Man carries in their stores. It's not a Top Man shirt, it's from Selected, and ironically, it says the perfect tee on the back right here, which, as a result of the last video, is like it might not be the perfect tee for you, but for me and for this video, it is. And that's look number two. Let's check out the next one. Look number three is perfectly walking the line between the first very casual look and the second very dapper look with an unstructured blazer up top and a pair of raw denim jeans on the bottom. I think a pair of raw denim jeans are ideal for pairings with sport coats and blazers just because they have a little bit more of an elegant vibe even though they're a pair of denim. To really accentuate the like legereness of this look, I did kind of like a half tuck so it's kind of just tucked in a little bit and then tucked out on the other half, which I really like. I think it works for the whole vibe of the look. I popped the color, pushed up the sleeves, like I did with the suit also. I actually meant to mention that to you guys. Just making it even more casual because we're dressing it down with a white t-shirt and with white sneakers. Look number four, and we're getting a little bit more grungy and a little bit more to the street side of how you can style your white tee. I'm wearing a pair of skinny black jeans from Zara that I just picked up. They're in store. I really like them. I was wearing my Mango Man skinny jeans for a while. They, I washed them a couple times. They got too skinny. These I like a little bit more and up top I'm wearing my biker jacket from Coach. So an all black and white look, really straightforward. Black and white is something that's been working for ages in many different fields, not only fashion. I think it's clean, simple. You can't really mess up with color combination when you're keeping it achromatic, so lacking color entirely. And the look is badass, I think, yet it's still a little sporty and a little bit more accessible than like an all black look with black boots that just makes you look super grungy and rock and roll. I think this is just walking the line once again beautifully between between like a more casual look and a more grungy look. And lastly, look number five, with a white base like a white t-shirt, you can play with color a lot more easily if you decide to just take one color and really go for that. In this case, I'm wearing a pair of light wash jeans that aren't really taking the color scope to like an extreme level. But up top, I'm wearing a bomber jacket from John Elliott in a beautiful Bordeaux color. You've probably seen it a couple times on his channel already. Really, I could wear any color I wanted up top right now. It could be blue, green, purple, orange or Bordeaux, 
It's easy because the base of the entire look is white and then denim, which to me is kind of a neutral when it comes to fashion, even though it's technically blue. Denim just works as a neutral palette. And the white t-shirt is obviously very open and very receptive to any color that you might want to have fun with. That's it for today's video. That's five looks and five, I think, very different looks. And I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope one of the looks was for you, or maybe all of them were for you. Leave a comment down below on how you rock your white tees. I would love to know. And if you're not subscribed to my channel yet, make sure to change that and hit that little bell so you don't miss out on the videos as soon as they become available online. So you're the first ones to start getting on that style advice. Thank you guys so, so much for watching today. I'll see you very soon with the next video. Until then, as always, stay dapper. Bye. Pretty pee roll.